Hi everyone, welcome to Miss Wang's Kitchen. I am Mi Wang. Today I'm going to show you how to make peanuts, lotus roots, and chicken feet soup. First, cut off the tips of each chicken feet. This is for a better presentation. You can omit this step if you want. Add the chicken feet in a pot of boiling water. With the lid on, bring it to a boil over high heat. Then turn off the heat and drain off the water. Rinse the chicken feet with cold tap water, and then place them back to the soup pot. Fill the pot with water that's just enough to cover all the feet. Then bring it to a boil again. Meanwhile, we can peel off the shells of the peanuts. You can usually find these raw peanuts in Chinese markets. Next, snap off each segment of the lotus root. Peel off the skins. Cut the lotus roots into big pieces. Rinse up the dirt on the lotus roots and the peanuts. Then add them into the soup. Bring the soup to a boil again. When it is boiling, leave the lids open slightly. Reduce the heat to medium. Let the soup boil for another full hour. I bought some extra lotus roots for garnish. Cut the roots into many thin pieces. Add them into a bowl of cold water. Add a dash of rice vinegar and salt. Let them soak in the water until used. Add some salt to taste. And the soup is done. But my family likes soup contains a thick consistency. I make another version here. After I remove all the chicken feet, blend the soup with the lotus roots and peanuts until smooth. Over medium heat, deduct the soup until it reaches the thickness you like, while skimming off the foam on the surface. At the same time, dry the soaked lotus roots on the paper towel. Deep fry them in some vegetable oil over high heat. It takes only about 30 seconds to make, so be careful not to burn them. To serve, place the soup in the soup bowl, and then add the lotus chips in the center. And it is done. Sprinkle some black pepper or herbs on top if you like. Thanks for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it. See you next time.